Hello, Valiant fans, and welcome. I'm Tim Gallagher here with Coach Kevin Kelly of your field hockey team. 11-8 and eight last year uh, as you took your field hockey team, finishing fifth place, a little bit disappointing, maybe try and get into the Freedom Conference this year. What's going to be the biggest thing this year in transitioning from last year into fifth place and trying to make a real run into the playoffs? Well, I think the um, addition of some of our new players are coming in, uh, particularly to return to Sharon Federa, who we didn't have last year, uh, to help support um, our people up front, in particular uh, Amanda. And I think those three people are going to make a, a pretty big difference in how we finish up in the conference because it was disappointing and it was, a, it was a tough way to finish out, but we have much higher expectations this year. So obviously you mentioned Amanda, huge year for her last year, breaking and shattering records left and right, and a uh, player of the year not only in the Freedom Conference, but really overall nationally getting national um, you know, records as well. So what is a player like her going to mean to a, this team this year coming off a year that she had last year? Well, clearly, uh, the her ability and her leadership on the field is going to be standout. Uh, the advice she can give to younger players, you know, in terms of how to negotiate the field, and also her understanding of the game, what's going to happen. I mean, Amanda this year is going to be facing quite a different year than she had last year, particularly with the double coverage she's going to be getting. But we think we can use that to our advantage, and she knows how to handle that coverage, and maybe we're going to get some of the players opened up who in the past we didn't, because she knows that the concentration is going to be on her, and that's going to be a lot to deal with on the field. So obviously a year older now, a senior is Amanda. The leadership's going to be a lot more for her. Is that going to be a problem, you think, for her to handle? No, I, I don't think so. It's uh, We have three captains, three senior captains. Uh, and Amanda, though, she's very quiet. She kind of leads by example. Um, she gets the job done. Kids look up to her. When she speaks, they all listen. So she's got all the great qualities of a captain and somebody who I think is really going to be a standout, not only on the field but off the field as a valiant and one of our leaders of this team. I see on your roster a lot of your returners coming back from last year are really on the defensive side of the ball. Is that going to be your most dynamic position this year for your field hockey team? Well, you know, I, I was a goaltender in my life, so I, I coached from the defense up. Um, we brought in three goalies as, as freshmen, too. So uh, I like a very, very strong defense because the defense, it's an old saying, but the defenses do win championships, and that's where we're headed this year. We're looking to win that championship and try to generate the offense right from the goalie up, and that's what we're kind of focusing on right now. And Amy Hillen coming back, she's a senior this year for you guys. As you mentioned, you're bringing in a couple of freshman goaltenders. What does a player like Amy mean for your, for your team, you know, for the fact that she's going to have to, you know, help progress these goaltenders coming up? Well, having Amy around, you know, she, she's been the one goaltender we've managed to have for all four years. Uh, so she's had tremendous experience behind her. One year she was the only goalie we had. Um, and Amy, also a captain, is in incredibly vivacious on the field, uh, very loud, uh, very instructional up and down the field. Uh, and I think for the new kids, that's going to be, you know, having that kind of confidence behind them where she can direct. She's not afraid to step up, tell the defense to get out of the way. Um, you know, she has the confidence of a senior and she's playing with that kind of confidence. And we're just looking forward to really have a breakout year this year and hopefully hopefully you know really lead us to where we want to go so ultimately coach what are your highest expectations that you have for this club this year the highest expectations we want to get into the NCAA and I realize that's a pretty high expectation but we feel this year it's probably the best team we've assembled in the six years we're here uh, we have some seniors who really have a point to make in their, their final year we have very good goaltending we have a very good crew of freshmen who have come in and so you know if we're going to shoot let's shoot for the stars and that's what we're going for Coach, thank you for joining us here today. I really appreciate the time. Until the next time, I'm Tim Gallagher, and remember, go Valiants.